Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Rini, this is the Enchanted Planner, and today we're planning for the last week of September in my vertical. So originally I picked like Lobster Day or something for this week, <laughs> but that's really not jiving with me, so we're going a different direction. What I did pull out was Fall Harvest, because even though I'm in a love-hate relationship with my Happy Planner sticker books, <laughs> still trying to use them so I think we're going to go this direction now last year when I used this spread I think I used a good portion of like all of the animals and stuff so I think we're going to be reserved to florals sadly we're not going to have much other opportunity because otherwise there's not really a lot in here that works with my decorating style but we're going to figure that out so let's take these guys off the desks and Let's flip that over. I pulled out, of course, all my tools. I pulled out this grid washi because I actually think this will pair like fairly well. That's a terrible, <laughs> that's be <me> something. <clears throat> Excuse me, I think it'll pair fairly well with this. What I'm not sure of is if we want to bring in any other kind of washi. That's where I'm kind of on the fence. All right, so what are we working with? If we're looking at doing, all right, maybe we'll go to the florals first and see what I've got left in here. So I've got all these pieces, I've got these bigger ones, and then we've got like the floral layered boxes, question mark. Okay, so let's pull. And the funny thing is, is this is such a beautiful sticker book, but it's I didn't find it super easy to work with at one point last year. I can't remember if it was my vertical spread I did with it or if it was my horizontal because I also used this in my horizontal uh, planner last year let's just grab all these little bits and pieces because whether I use them or not they do need to kind of come out of the book okay so can anyone else <laughs> believe like I'm kind of in I don't know, what's the right word damn menopause stealing my mind um, I'm kind of in awe I guess would be a word but not the word I was looking for the fact that it's almost October. It's crazy to me how incredibly fast this year is flying by. Fun fact, I don't actually drink pumpkin spice anything. <laughs> if I want pumpkin spice, I'll eat it in a pie. I don't want to drink my pumpkin, I want to eat it. Um, okay, so we've got fall in love with today, but I don't really want that kind of thing. Maybe we'll grab this sweater weather. It's not really a good matching vibe, and it's badly cut, which is another pain in the ass. Okay, well, I don't want that one then. What else do we have as options? Ugly stickers. I'm sorry, these look like quilts, like granny quilts, you know? <laughs> don't ask. Don't ask. Um, I mean, that's the same florals, but it's it's a fall in love with today. I don't want that for the sidebar. Annoying. What else could we put in the sidebar? Like, there's lots of stuff. Hmm. I'm going to end up having to bring in some boxes, I think, because there's not really a large amount to work with in here. I mean, we have these ones. And these also... So we've got a couple of different, there's a couple of very distinct color palettes going on in this book. And it's just a matter of trying to figure out what one I want to work with. Do we go brighter and lighter or more muted? Kind of like in the brighter and lighter. So I think we're going to do that. We're going to grab one of these guys and decide where we're going to put this. But if we flip you around, that's why I love wax paper. <laughs> wax paper is my buddy. Um, maybe we'll put it smack dab in the center. Let's see if I can actually get it lined up properly. Even though I'm trying to line it up with boxes, I'm still having issues. Okay, so let's put that smack dab in the middle. Now, I do kind of want something on this side that sort of ties in those florals and is a box. So fingers crossed, we can find something. It's not Thanksgiving here yet. Soon. 
because ours is October 9th. We do have those. And then we have these. Do we have a double box that has those florals in them? No, of course not. <laughs> I mean, at least these are somewhat in the same kind of color palette, but if we're not doing... Uh, now I remember why this book, <clears throat> excuse me, was a bit difficult to work with. It's all coming back to me now. Okay, so let's go to our floral box things, and we're going to grab another one. I'm just going to decide if we're going to go what direction I want to go. Is... Nope, that's a hard pass. Let's put that guy back. I'll fix it later. I'm going to go orange. And I'm not thrilled with that either. Well, I'm not thrilled with that either, but I think out of the three of them, that's probably our best fit. All right, well, if we take this right down into actually like the corner of the page, this can be my box for Saturday. I'm going to move that though, I think. Ah, or not. Note to self, these are rather delicate. <laughs> or at least for my heavy hands. Do I want? I don't know. I mean, we could... What, okay, you know what? We're not getting any younger. Let's just see how I feel about that. It's kind of interesting because we're taking it right into the sidebar and out of the defined boxes, if you will. And this can kind of be like my list for the week. So I think we're going to do it. Why not, right? Let's be different. I don't really want it to cover up Monday, though. So let's move it down just slightly. And it would help if I can get it straight. <laughs> Even with the lines, I can't line things up, you guys. Come on. Come on, stickers. Cooperate. Cooperate. Okay. Oh, my gosh. It keeps sticking to my freaking fingers. There's a, a story that goes along with that. My nephew was probably, I want to say five or six. Like he was still fairly young. And... My mom <clears throat> had said, she was talking about the African violet she had on her table. And my nephew gets all quiet and he whispers to my sister. And my sister just starts busting a gut. And no one understands because they've missed the joke, right? So she says to, she says to my nephew, Bryce, and she says, that's not swearing. And of course, my mom and I are rather puzzled. And Yvonne says, because she said African, he figured that grandma was swearing, saying, ah, frickin'. <laughs> Out of the mouths of babes, right? <laughs> ah, they're so cute sometimes. Okay, we have a start, at least. Now, we can kind of work, I think, on the sidebar from that. And the only thing that really is going to kind of work is this pumpkin spice and everything nice kind of deal, which I'm not thrilled with, but... What we gonna do? All right, but we do need to get rid of this guy. Oh, my arms are sore. Not sore, they're fatigued. <laughs> I just finished a chest workout before I started filming. So my uh, chest and arms are a little bit fatigued. All right, so let's plunk this guy right about there. He's not straight. Of course he's not straight. I even have dotted grid to like line him up against. Okay. Now, what do we need to do in this bottom? I've got like a hair stuck here. It's one of mine, of course. <laughs> oh, the other wonderful thing about menopause, I'm going bald all the time. And this is like a really gray hair or a blonde hair. Come on, where are you? Let me know in the comments if you have this issue. <laughs> like, do you find your hair everywhere? But the thing that's troubling not troubling, well, kind of troubling, is I used to have very thick 
hair. Lots of it and very thick. Now my hair is quite fine. And so when it falls out, I don't necessarily always see it because it's blonde or it's gray. And, you know, it'll be on my bathroom floor. It's just annoying. Or I find it like in the waistband of my pants. Like, <laughs> can somebody just like, I don't know. We get ripped off. We just, we get burned so badly. <laughs> okay, so what do we want to do? I don't really want, hmm, hmm, this one might work. So we'll pull that out. We do have checklists, so I can bring checklists in. They're not my favorite, as you guys know. But again, Operation used the stickers, right? These are interesting. Where did they go? These guys. I just wish they all didn't say the exact same thing. Or that they were actual headers, like today or important. <laughs> Instead of... Okay, we have these larger kind of floral pieces and I'm trying to decide if I wanna bring one of them in down here in this corner to sort of fill in this bottom section. All right, let the de-sticking begin. Is this big enough? Not really. Okay, well, there's that one. This one is much bigger. Although this one looks like it's actually meant for a corner. It's just not large. You know what? I'm going to say it's good enough. It's good enough. We will need to eliminate some lines, but we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Let's stick this in. I'm going to come at it like this. I think I kind of want to come at it like this because it keeps the brown tones. And... I can bring in more of that color on this side of the page. Okay, so while that dries, we have to figure out some other things. Finding boxes for this is gonna be a nightmare. Because it's not like I'm gonna find those colors in pretty much anything else I probably have. We have this, which it's not optimal, but it's at least somewhere close to the same colors. <laughs> <laughs> like we gotta work with what we got people <clears throat> we also have these so we can bring in one of those and one of those and what the heck um actually we'll bring in one of those because that brings in more of that ruddy color not ruddy color um this orangey color that's sort of in the it's an orangey brown um i'm not thrilled with those as we all know um, these, absolutely not. Not happening. These aren't too bad. I just wish they weren't foil. These ones will work, though. Okay, so we got kind of sort of our checklist for the store of the week, or I could put, like, this is my top three, or this is my goals box, whatever I decide to put up in that section. So let's go over to these little floral pieces. Because I think these will also work quite well to help bring in some more. Um, I have a few more corner pieces. We have actually quite a few corner pieces with this, so there's no no lack for the corner pieces. So we will stick that kind of down there like that, right? Helps offset a little bit of this other stuff. Where's my sticker squisher? That's not a sticker squisher. This is a sticker squisher. I'll white out the other stuff after I make a decision on whether that's staying there. We could also grab this and plunk this across the top here. So we have a header in this box, like so. Okay, it's coming together. I didn't know how this was going to go when I sat down. I've got a piece of tape here that is driving me a bit crazy, so let's get rid of that. I really need to replace this backdrop, but I haven't found anything I like. So... It's a tough one now because I want it to I want to I want it to look good obviously. Okay, because we have sort of a check where, where were those checklists? Let's go back to our checklist situation here. You were here somewhere. Where are you? Where's the checklists? Did I pass them? Or are they at the front of the damn book and I just haven't gone far enough in them? 
So one thing that's troublesome with Happy Planner sticker books, okay, because I, I don't usually have this issue when I'm planning with Live Love Posh. I do not have to flip multiple times through the sticker book looking for what I'm looking for. So, it's, you know, one of those trade-off things, right? Okay, um, I think we'll grab one of these and we're going to put the checklist in right here like so. Okay, and then I want a checklist on this side. So I think that's how we're going to bring this lighter green color in is we're going to put a checklist over here like so. It's not completely against the lines, but um, okay, hold on. Hold on, let me just shift it over. Why are you crooked? It's not the sticker. It's got to be me. <laughs> Can't be the sticker. Well, I mean, they could be miscut, but they're certainly not going to be crooked. Okay, so we've got a couple of those. I think what we're going to do is we're going to grab... Let's go back to our small boxes here. So I think we're going to come in... I don't know what I've got going on this week. It's probably a better idea to take a look at my monthly, right? Um, okay, so this is a fairly light week. There's a full moon on the 29th, and I need like some kind of box on the 27th and the 28th. But other than that, it's kind of carte blanche on whatever it is I want to do. So I think we're going to grab this and this. And we're going to make a little tiny layered cluster here. Let's move that. Actually, I don't like that that way. So let's put him. Hopefully he is it's not straight because it's always hard when they're floating boxes. And we're going to put that one like that. And then we're going to grab one of our itty bitty little floral pieces here somewhere. Like they've got these little things. Actually, you know what? We'll leave that because there might be other things in the book I can use, like some of the little cute... These guys. Like, aren't these like freaking cute? <laughs> like, I'm down. I think they're super cute. So that's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to grab one of these guys. Mm, that doesn't quite work, but we will come back to that. All right. Um, our box situation is not getting any better here because I don't have a lot. You know, it's funny because Happy Planner either goes super crazy with functional and not much decorative, or they go too much decorative and not enough functional. In this case, they have a little bit of everything, but it's not what I'm looking for. <laughs> Murphy's Law, right? It's always the way. It's always the way. I'm half tempted to grab this box and cut off all the florals. Because we do need a box. I don't really want to destroy a perfectly good box, but they've not really given me much option. Because there's like, these don't work. It's not, I don't want to pull it in. That's the, it's, it's not the right not the right theme within the book if I was doing like the animals and stuff we're doing kind of a floral thing here so it's not really it's not really vibing it's not really jiving I wish these were on clear okay well we are back to do I destroy a perfectly good box or do I see if I can find something that kind of matches fingers crossed right that one's close. Actually, that's pretty good. But that is a pretty good match. All right, my other one that I was going to look at was like the browns. It's black. I think Mojo went more on the cool side in here, but I could be wrong. No, she went more on the warmer side. Okay, well, none of those work, but the orange does. So we have kind of something to work with. So let's go in here and grab one of my absolute favorite sizes. I'm half tempted to bring in another checklist. Why not, right? We gotta use the mop. Let's let's see what we got to work with. Um we could bring in one of these green ones. I'm gonna put it over here or here. Let's have a looky loo. Mm, not really fond of that. Let's put it over here on Wednesday. Mm. 
<laughs> I'm not eating, but you know, we're not going to complain. All right, so then we're going to grab another one of these and I'm going to put it over here on Saturday. Okay. So we've got some function stuff. We definitely, we can't deny that, man. There's definitely function. We have bigger florals. I want something for kind of like slow down and enjoy the moment. Maybe question mark. That just looks kind of random. Kind of looks rando. But what about if we bring in like a small box cluster? So we could grab, let's go back to our skinny boxes. Come in, actually that's kind of too big itself. So do we go in and grab one of these guys? I just don't want everything to be the same size. I like to mix it up a bit so things look a little bit different. Because we could do something like putting these guys together like, not like that, don't you see that? Don't do that. <laughs> kind of like in here somehow. Again, I kind of messed myself up because I'm putting things in places that I don't normally put them and I'm using things I don't normally use. But I also like to give you guys ideas on how to use different things in different places. So that's why we do this. One, it's a challenge for me. And two, it's helpful, useful possibly to y'all. Oh, it's so big. I love this sticker, but I can't seem to get it in yet. <laughs> yet being the operative word there but we do have other things like stay cozy these are all in foil I wish these weren't all in foil but at least it makes sense because it is autumn and you know copper foil and rose gold makes sense at this time of year we have little pumpkins these are kind of cute too we could bring in some pumpkins because pumpkins are abound they are like a plenty right now and huge like I've seen some huge pumpkins this year okay so I think that's going to be our game plan we're going to grab a pumpkin put the pumpkin right there and then we're going to grab one of these flat white ones and we're going to put that right beside it Like so, cute. Let's flatten that all out so we get the bubbles out. Okay, let's put this off the side for a moment while we kind of take a look at what's going on on this side. So we have this big sort of autumn vibes box, which I was kind of thinking about bringing in, but I'm not so sure it works with what I've got going on currently because so far everything has been using more of like the vertical width for boxes instead of something that's more aligned for a horizontal. So let's head back in here and see what else we can work with. Do we want a quote? I don't really want a double box up there. We do have like this big quote. Maybe that's how I get sweater weather. I mean, you know what I mean? Like it's definitely sweater, sweater weather right now. <laughs> it's coming, although it's rather warm today. So let's see, we could put this guy kind of hanging out up there. I don't need a ton on the weekends, as most of you guys know, because I don't do a ton on the weekends. Like we have our errands that we run, so we'll go to the grocery store and go to Costco and that kind of deal. But we don't really need a ton. That would look cool, but it's not going to work. We don't really need a ton. Okay, I'm going to sort of temporarily place that there in case I find something I like better. Like, I'm half tempted to grab some more florals. I'm running out of room on my thing. Okay, grab some more florals because we have these, like, side pieces. Which would certainly help fill in the space if we come at it like that. 
And then we put the sweater weather back underneath kind of deal. Maybe it just looks wrong. <laughs> it just looks wrong. What about if we bring in and that just looks weird. It just looks weird. I don't like it. Okay, there's tons of stuff to work with in this book, so we will find something. Like maybe this pumpkin season one. That gets pumpkins on this side of the page. That's an idea too, so we'll plunk that down there. We have nature is the best medicine for serenity, peace, calmness, and stillness. It's good for the heart. So that's, I mean, like a larger quote, but it's in foil. I could go and grab one of my quote books and possibly find something that will work, which is always an idea as well. Again, the flipping through the sticker books is not something I have to do when I'm working with Live Love Posh because I just sort of pick one of the themes and we're good to go. Okay, let me have a look here. This looks kind of random. I'm not going to lie. I'm not necessarily thrilled about that, but I'm wondering if we grab... These aren't really big enough. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not digging it. <laughs> I'm really not digging it. <laughs> Maybe it's because it's kind of crooked too. So there is that. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. We do have these little guys, which I could pop kind of in there to sort of help fill in the space. My wax paper is ripping. makes a little bit of difference. I wonder if we pop something in like that. Yeah, I'm undecided. So we'll put that guy off the side for a second. Like overall, this side's kind of doable. It's this side that I'm on the struggle bus with. And I think it's because I kind of shoehorned myself into a situation. But we might be able to fix that by doing this. I think we'll go, I think we'll go down instead of up. Odd, but I might be able to use my, <laughs> nope, still not. Keep, keep trying. I'm going to keep trying. Slow down and enjoy the moment. It's too big, so we won't use that. I think we're reserved to possibly bringing in florals. I could bring in some more pumpkins because I don't have pumpkins on this side of the page yet. Unless I bring that quote in. That's the wrong shape. Okay, so where'd my pumpkin quote go? Here's my pumpkin quote. Here's my pumpkin quote. Because if I bring this guy in, it also ties in the pumpkins on the other side. And I think that's what we're literally going to do is just sort of set that down there. Now here's where I'm on the fence, like, cause I could easily fix this by grabbing some really skinny washi and laying down some washi, which might help. So two sex, my lovies. All right, <laughs> I had to play around a bit. Um, I brought in some washi and I, I sort of figured out a few placements for a few things. Like I moved, I changed the sticker out and I moved it around and I moved the pumpkin spice sticker down. I haven't decided if I like that year. So that's why it's not whited out underneath. But I think we are pretty much done. I've been trying to figure out something to do with this little area here. So I brought out like a quote, which was like, slow down and enjoy the moment, which just kind of looks random, just sort of sitting here in the middle. So I'm not thrilled with that. I also brought out one of these boxes here to see if this could help balance it out. But again, this is a planner. I don't necessarily need a ton, like because I've got a checklist here. And we've got focus boxes sort of on each day. I don't really need a ton of these kind of boxes, question mark. And then I was like, well, I wonder about this guy, but he just looks weird. <laughs> just looks weird. So I'm undecided about this area, but I do want to pop a few of these cute icons in on here. So we're going to grab like the little fox slippers because these are just bloody adorable. And I think they'll fit rather well right here. So let's angle them that way. So we'll put those guys there. We've got pumpkins on both sides, so we're good there. But I think I'm going to grab 
of the toque, this guy here. And we're gonna bring the toque in and bring that over here like so, cause it's cute. And I love these little things, I think they're adorable. And I wasn't able to get in my warm wishes, so we're, we're adapting. I wanna see if I can grab something from up here as well. Um, warm socks, little boots. The boots are kind of cute. I don't know if they really work though, cause you know, but hey, why not? Uh, it's a little weird, not gonna lie, it's a little weird. So, we have mittens though. They're just kind of big. And just like, yeah, I don't like the placement of them. I think that's part of the part of the issue. So we'll throw those back down. We have a pair of sunglasses. I mean, it is still kind of sunny here. Like today's actually a really, really nice day. It was cold this morning, but it's bright blue skies and uh, I'm not digging that either. So we might be SOL. Unless I take that sweater and I just cut off the warm wishes, which is another idea. And you were probably yelling at me for a while just to do that. So let's cut off the little wishes and grab the sweater. Oh yeah, there we go. There we go. And then I could probably sneak this little warm wishes in somewhere because it's like super cute. I don't know where. <laughs> Actually, you know what? Let's just put it right on the box. So it's still sort of somewhat near its friend, but it's not attached to it. Okay, um, and I think I'm done. I don't know about this corner down here. Like I said, that's the only thing I did look at their little, um, there's bullet points in here. And that was one thing I did look at. I do wanna get one of those things on here, like another one of these though. So let's go to, that section and that's grab I guess today's plans because we don't really have any other options and we'll bring that guy in right here and that's usually where I'm running around doing errands and stuff and I don't think there's really much else in here for headers they have headers but they're on paper and I'm not really thrilled with that we have these Then we have these, but I have another idea for those that I want to save for another one of those, like use the weird stickers. So I'm going to hang on to those for now. Okay, so I guess the only option we have for clear is these guys. All right, well, why not? Let's go in. We'll bring them in, man. May as well, right? Today, what else we got? Weekend plans, priority, uh, celebrate, important and remember. I prefer it when they're not all wonky script, <laughs> uh, but hey, we'll use what we got, right? And like I said, I'm still on the fence about that corner down there. I'm just not, not digging it, man. I mean, my only other option would be to change this flower out for the larger one that was in here, which might take up a bit more space like this one. But I don't really want to do that either. So maybe we just leave it and I just enjoy the white space. I mean, what's my other option? We did pull out sweater weather. Let's take a look at this one. Maybe this is our winner. Well, not really. <laughs> not really, but. Yeah, I don't know, man. I'm having like serious struggles with this one, unless I literally just put it in the middle and call it done. And I think that's what we're gonna do. I'm just gonna leave it as is, as it is. <laughs> Before I won, take a bajillion years to finish this plan with me. And do I have to, no, I don't have to punch anything. So let's put these back on the desks. And let's see what it looks like. Well, I'm undecided on this spread. I'm not sure how I feel about it, <laughs> but that's a wrap. Okay, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, of course, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next time.